boys, how's it going? Listen, Colgan here. Got the phone call off Andy Ryan this morning. Do you want to go in the gym? Can't fucking wait for a boy. Reds is going to be in there. I'm going to do a few of them. He's going to do a few of them. We're going to talk, chat music, chat fighting, chat life. Come on. How are you boys? How's it going? Shoes, shoes, shoes. Huh? I can't because I've got long toenails. Get your shoes off. Oh. Sorry now, I just... I forgot to clean my feet. That one... That one's a bit dirtier than that one. That's sound. All right. You see it? All good. Two heroes in the gym together. <laughs> this is your home. This is the gym. Tell us about your home. Uh, so this is where like, most of the training gets done. Yeah. Um, there's the cage with Chris Barton in there. And you do your jiu-jitsu, uh, wrestling, everything else here. Your bag walking. Right. A couple of weights over there. Do you ever find with the jiu-jitsu that it's kind of like a waste of time if you're in a street fight <laughs> and you're like, you've got a lad in an arm bar and you're there for an hour and you know, you're like, fuck it. Could be off home now. <laughs> No, I don't get into street fights. Do you not yes. anymore? No. <laughs> why, why? You can't get into street fights if you're an MMA fighter? No. Why is that? Just can't. Just there's a new law? Yeah. Yeah, that's fair enough. How, how often do you work out in here? Twice a day, six days a week. Serious? Mm -hmm. Personally for myself, I'm not saying like you boys don't work out a lot, but I pretty much work out <laughs> all the time. I was born working out, like I'm just always doing stuff. Right, what's the prize? Pride. I'll give you a thousand quid if you beat me. Sound. One. Oh. You're good. Fuck it, this one's flat. Yeah. Huh? It's still sharp. Story me life. <laughs> right, draw. We call it a draw, yeah? Fair fox. <laughs> Is there any way to lie down? Yeah, just crash you out in the match there. Just lie down. You're brand new. Tell us a few of the jiu-jitsu things. <laughs> what you got? <laughs> what the fuck? And you got knocked out? Yeah. Yeah, but myself and the outlet, we're still friends now. <laughs> What's the story with headlocks? Yeah, you, could, could you yeah. use them in a fight? Yeah. Any good? I've never seen, I've never seen anyone use them. Roy McDonald, all the big boys, Fedor, yourself. I've never seen you doing headlocks. <coughs> see, I was thinking if you get them in a headlock, and just, the other way. just crank it up like that. And just, you know, see the way the legs are like that? Just, you just crank. Do you want to do it to me? I'll give it a go. You got them like that, right? You're like, and you actually have to say crank, and then their neck is kind of like up like that. And then you, they're, like, they're trying to straighten out their neck and you're just like, fuck off. Huh? So if you put your head in here. I don't know about that now. I'll give it a go, but just don't squeeze. So we put the head down and I have one over, one under. Nice. And I turn like this. <laughs> Does that work? No. Would you want to tap out to that? Um, I wouldn't get into that situation in the first place, to be honest. Your story with the diet. Tell me about your diet. What do you be putting in your body? What comes out of you? Uh, so you've got carbs, vegetables, Bread, proteins. milk, cheese. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's be more like porridge, uh, chicken, turkey, veg. That All in stuff. a blender and then you're like... <laughs> See, the thing about me is I just... I kind of eat anything I want. Like, there's times where I, w I wake up at 4 o'clock in the morning and if I want a sandwich, I'm like, I'm having a sandwich. So when I'm in a fight, you know yourself, I'm always fighting. The guy is you who's losing, and I'm like, all right, bye. And then I go like this. Yeah, like this. <laughs> Wait, stop, stop, stop. Right. You're gonna choke him out now. Right. So that hand there, round the head. Pull this one out, look. Grab your bicep, hand behind the head, pull him back, Cruise choke him, him yeah? yeah? Pull him, move back. Walk back, walk back. That's it, drag him down. That's it, hook, yeah, perfect. Gone. <laughs> <coughs> Man in the street always wins. Excellent. Good stuff. Put another tip in your belt. Do you know, I wouldn't mind going to the ring myself now, give it a go. Do you want to get geared up? Drugs like. <laughs> okay, so we're going to get some boxing gloves on. Uh, uh, two left. Two left. Left and a right. Some boxing gloves. Yeah. And. Headgear. Right. Let's fucking do it, boy. You're not wearing anything yourself, no? No, I'll be all right. You sure enough? This is me bread and butter. Stick that on me. This is so tough sometimes. So, did you ever wake up scared? Stick it on me. Ah, oh, that's the one. That's the shot. Right. I feel like I'm looking through, I don't know, someone's letterbox. <laughs> you not putting on one yourself? No, I'll be all right. You sure? I'll be grand. Yeah? Yeah. Come on. Come on. 
Get the jobs down at the pump. That'd bother on me. Draw, I suppose. You cut a draw. Just, just put a bit of water in my face. Not sweat. It's water. Uh, good draw. Myself and Paul Reds are, we're both good fighters. We're both good men. Good luck. <laughs>